and with that we welcome you to PZW Rocket episode number six last week we had a packed episode tonight it's gonna cool down a bit we're here in Hamburg Germany and we are set for big action nonetheless we're gonna start off with John Moxley we haven't seen him since the Royal Rumble where he beat Cody Rhodes he's gonna talk I don't know what he's gonna say but we're gonna find out then we're gonna see Jimmy Havoc take on Tommaso Ciampa after Jimmy won last week against Cody in a very weird way then we've got Cody Rhodes on the show he is talking as well so he's also here yeah we've got a big two-on-two tag team matchup Kyle O'Reilly, Bobby Fish are accompanying Adam Cole and AJ Styles which finally have a name undisputed and phenomenal to the ring against the OC Luke Gallows and Carl Anderson then we've got singles action and another debut as we've got Kenny Omega taking on Dolph Ziggler who is here with his good friend Sami Zayn and I hope that's gonna stay all good and in the main event you've seen it last week unfold between Seth Rollins and Matt Jackson in the opener of our show Seth Rollins talking us through his win of the Royal War match tonight he's gonna take on Matt Jackson so let's see what happens tonight as we kick off with John Moxley talking and here is John Moxley. Let's see what he has to say. All right, PZW Universe. As you know, I am the best wrestler here. And those jobbers back there, they also know. I have defeated Cody at the Royal Rumble. Fair and square. But after the match, someone ran out. And that someone knows I'm talking about him. It's the big red idiot Kane. He ran out and confronted me. He's standing there trying to get me scared, but no, that doesn't happen. I'm not scared of a guy in a Halloween costume. Yes, he maybe has been fighting in the industry for over 30 years, but that doesn't mean I couldn't beat him. I have knowledge that he doesn't have. The knowledge of a 50 year veteran. That's right, because I'm the best wrestler here and in the whole world, and I will prove that by winning. The World Championship. And before I do that, I will win the lockdown match. But before that, I will take on Kane. And since he is probably under the ring anyways, waiting to pull me under it, why don't you give me your answer? Come on, come out here and give me your answer. Alright, sorry for calling you an idiot, but at least accept my challenge, because I know you want it. Alright, you know what? Give me an answer next week or I'll go find you by myself. But about next week, I have something to announce. Next week, there will be six instead of three to four matches. Those six will be the qualifiers for the lockdown chamber match. I will be in a tables match against the what people call UK's deathmatch master, Jimmy Havoc. Alright, now I'm done talking to this boring people. Go to hell. Wow, John Moxley, pretty mean to the PZW universe here today. Let's go on to our first matchup of the night and here we are everyone for match number one and we have a special guest it's plain we're underway here yeah how's everyone doing in quarantine we've got a great matchup to start off the show between Jimmy Havoc and Tommaso Ciampa already a big slam right there oh wait he reverses all of it, Tommaso Ciampa also reverses. And a big knee. Yeah, he's out loading on him right now. Oh, and a huge drop kick. 
Now he stomps him and gets him back up. Looks like a suplex. Oh, wait. There we go. Hits it. And again, lifting him up. Torture rack. Driver. Gets him back up. Arm wrench. He reverses it. Jimmy Havoc. Neck breaker. A big move right there. Oh wait, he drops under. Close line. What a big move right there. Now they lock up. Oh wait. Man, a discus forearm. Pin. And a kick out at one. Oh wait. Man, what a DDT. Cover and no. Kick out before one. Now he gets him back up. What is he going to do? Oh, wait. Puts him on his back there. A snap mare. Ouch. A big shot to the head. A cover. And another kick out at one by Havoc. Havoc over a win against Cody. Of course, Cody is here tonight as well. Right after this match, actually. To say something. Yeah, it's probably going to be patient, but we've got a submission, sleeper hold, I think. Oh, wait. He lands on his feet, drops him, punch is prone. Now what is he going to do here? I was a bit confused. I don't know if he knows. Oh, to the to the outside of the ring, to the ringside. Here we go. We know that Jimmy Havoc is capable of doing some very bad things here. Oh, into the steps though. Into the blinking steps he goes. And a big slap and an arm drag. Now back in, we've got a lantern there. Now back in, and another big close line. Tommaso Ciampa again rolling out of the ring. Getting back in now. Scoop slam. Now he's going top rope. Jimmy Avec. Oh, he misses it. He missed the target. Punch to the back there. Champa ducks. Kick to the. Oh gosh, no. Yep, pin. <laughs> Sorry for that noise. Oh, and another kick out. Get some back up. In the corner, oh man, an uppercut. Shoulders down, this could be it. That's what Michael Cole saying, but no. At one. Get them back up again. Huge Irish whip. Oh wait, they collide. Oh, a rake to the eyes. Come on, that's illegal. Now we lift him up though. Champa, of course, he's still frustrated about losing that match last week. Wait a minute. Oh no, this does not look good. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. The hardest part of the ring. Fans in the PZW universe chanting, this is awesome. They might be right. Yep. 
Yup. And he goes down hard on the outside. Whips him back into the ring. Oh, wait. Chamber rolling out. Now Snapmare. A gut punch. Arm drag. Havoc rolls out, getting a breather. Rolls back in. No Chamber, don't let him fool you. He's gonna hit. Look out. Oh, wait. He's fighting back. German suplex. Or belly to back. Another one. We saw this last week with John Cena and a third one. Yeah. It's on the channel. It's the last video on the channel. And here we go. Nope. Look like a Boston Crapper sharpshooter. He shoves him off and now into a chin lock. Champa, he's got him good. Oh wait, now Havoc getting a bit up. And an elbow to the gut. Two does it. He gets out of the hold. Hits a big punch. Looks for a discus. No, another snapmare. Kick to the back. This is a technical matchup here. These guys using... Yeah, pretty good match here. The chop, another chop. He catches a leg, a big knee to the face. Another snap mirror and another chin lock. Oh, it looks like Havoc has already countered it. He's got the hang of it now, Champa. Should try and hit. Yeah, should try and hit other moves. Champa now arm drag again. And his leg is on the rope there. Doesn't look good there. Hopefully he's all right. Oh man! And now punches to the to the head, man. I was gonna drag him. Maybe look for a cover here. I mean that could have knocked him out there at one point. He covers him. Two could be a no. Havoc gets out. Oh wait! Havoc back up. Tour of the island. Celtic cross. And that could be it. But he's setting up for something even bigger. Something like the... Acid Rainmaker. Into the cover. And that has to be it. One, two, three. No! He kicks out. Wow, what a matchup. People can't believe that that wasn't it. But he's looking for another one. Can he hit it? Champa looks to be out of it. A German suplex here. Big German. Looking for another. No, an acid rainmaker afterwards. What a combo. That could be it. One, two, three. Jimmy Havoc with a victory. What a rhyme. Man. A great opener here to Rocket. We've got more just like that. Up next, we've got that two-on-two, -two, of course, tag team matchup. This could determine the number one contender for lockdown, which is in two weeks from tomorrow. No, three weeks. I'm pretty sure. So what a matchup there. That was that acid rainmaker into the cover, and Champa somehow... Somehow kicked out at two. Jimmy Havoc with the victory. And up next, we've got Undisputed and Phenomenal against the OC. And here we are, everyone. Think, oh my gosh! What a spear immediately. Goodness. I don't know, a big spear there. Now lift him up. Side slam backbreaker. Not looking good for AJ Styles at the moment. Luke Gallows. Oh! Rolls out. 
And Carl Anderson into the match now. Now AJ Styles back into the ring and gets caught with an Enzigiri. Step up Enzigiri there. Gallows slams his head into the mat. Now what is he going to do here? Oh wait. AJ Styles now lifts him up. Brain Buster. And now, and just out side slam backbreaker or pendulum backbreaker, whatever. I didn't know. And now AJ Styles on the apron. Anderson looking at him. What is Styles? Styles. Um. Well then. It is. Styles just took himself out of this matchup apparently. I don't know why you would do that. And now the count started. It's a two. And here we go now. But maybe he just recovered there a bit. I don't know what he just did there, but whatever. Maybe he's going to do for go for it again. That's one for Botchamania. It would be in real life. And there we go. Springboard blockbuster or neck, neck breaker. And the attack is made here. Adam Cole into the matchup. Wait a minute. AJ Styles going top rope. Already chaos! Oh my gosh! Goodness! Carl Anderson now back into the ring. Look here. Figure for a leg lock. Yeah. Got it in. Could that be it? Oh no, wait. He lets go. This match, Missed the tag. And now he whips him out on the apron. A Wait a minute. Wait. Kyle Rott. Kyle. Kyle. What? What did he just do? He just pulled him off and he caused it. Just, oh my God! AJ Styles. What? What just? Well, that match goes to the OC then. They're the number one contenders then. Well then. Oh no, they're fighting. Oh boy, they're fighting. Well, it's a two-on-four situation here. Look at that! Oh, Anderson taken down into the ropes. I saw Gallows fly. Oh, and a super kick by Adam Cole. Oh, Adam Cole just took out the referee. This is absolute chaos. Now Anderson going after Adam Cole. I can't even call this. This is madness. And wait a minute, Finn Balor and Johnny Gargano. They're trying to help out the OC perhaps. These two guys took on them in the Royal Rumble, Sami Zayn and Dolph Ziggler, and now they're here to help out the OC. And oh, look at this, Gallus there, and now Johnny, oh no, wait. Oh my gosh, this action is everywhere. Look at Adam, oh my gosh. Total carnage, Jesus. And Johnny Gargano. Oh my god. They go through the best of that time. Oh. oh my god. Well, here comes security now. And oh, and EMT as well with a stretcher. My goodness, we'll be right back. Welcome back here, Rocket, the uh, emergency personnel right now. Getting Carl Anderson on a stretcher as he was kicked T probably suffered a shoulder injury or something oh my god no no don't do this Bobby Fish no oh my god and here is Cody he looks frustrated and sad is he alright well let's find out what he has to say maybe we're gonna find out As you probably noticed, the last few weeks I've lost match after match, and I'm beginning to think I'm just not good enough for this. I know that I still have to end something with Moxley, but before that, I think I need a challenge to get me ready. I have talked with the general manager slash Iron Man champion, John Cena, and he has given me a match for next week. I got to choose match type, match number, and my opponent. But, 
I think my opponent's name has slipped out of my mind. Candy Omega. And I will take him on in a no holds barred match. And since you all heard Moxley saying at least one interesting thing before the first match, it indeed will be a qualifier for the Lockdown Chamber match. So Kenny, my friend, I will see you next week. Wow, something very interesting. The challenge has been issued for next week against Kenny Omega by Cody. But hey, we don't have to wait for Kenny Omega till next week, because he's in action. NEXT! Third matchup of the night, and what a brawl that was. But we have a great matchup in the debuting Kenny Omega against... You're right, Dolph Ziggler, he is here to take on Kenny Omega. Let's see what he can do against him. Dolph Ziggler and Sami Zayn have been in the Royal Rumble pay-per-view. Brings Kenny Omega to the, wait a minute, he's getting on the top rope. Look out, oh, crossbody to start this matchup. Man, even more chaos tonight. Ziggler puts Kenny Omega into the corner. Kenny Omega turned around, a huge elbow. Battering ram right there. Oh, now a huge punch there by Kenny Omega. A knee right there. Omega, second rope, Phoenix Splash! Goodness gracious! From the second rope, he's already showing off his skill set. And man, what an announcement by Cody, of course. You can't forget that. Right before this matchup. Um, Kenny Maya already having a huge matchup next week. Trying to qualify for the lockdown match. And it's his second match. Look at this, leaping over, ducking under. Now they collide. Now Omega into the corner. Whoa. Oh, and now a huge kick right there. Omega goes down hard. Now Ziggler. Lift him up. Suplex. Huge suplex. Deadlift suplex there, and Omega rolling out saying no. He rolls back in. And a huge knee to the midsection there as Ziggler meets him. Omega now getting dragged. Now Omega to uh, Ziggler to the outside thrown by Omega. Omega now off the ropes. Where is he going to look for your baseball slide drop kick through the ropes? Man, what a skill set Omega has. Of course, he is what p many say. The best wrestler in the world. Sometimes I agree, sometimes I don't. You know, there's others. And a huge knee right there by Omega. Caught Ziggler right there. Ziggler into the corner. Another huge knee to the midsection. And to set up maybe for the baseball slide again. Omega going up. And the double foot stomp. Could that be it? Ziggler outloading. Or Omega outloading. Jeez. On Ziggler. So confused because this match is already. Could be a match of the year contender. But look at this. Ziggler takes him down. Ziggler takes down Omega. And a huge forearm right there. Now he's going to drag him. They might have. Got him KO'd. Maybe knocked out one and a kick out at one. These these guys are not even done yet. And now he caught him there. Huge knee to the head. And over the top rope goes Dolph Ziggler. And now Kenny Omega telling him get up. And 
and he catches him with a double axe hand or elbow, I don't know. And a huge, wait a minute, Sami Zayn getting involved now. Distracting Omega here, and once again, Sami Zayn's got to look out, he might get himself ejected here. Those are now taken up into the post. Down of six now into the post again goes Ziggler. Sami Zayn again going after him there. Going for stretch. Oh, and hard into the apron goes Omega there. Count of eight almost. Eight count is reached, but they're back into the ring now. Omega now. Oh, wait, Ziggler. Sleeper hold. Could be done here for Kenny Omega. But no. Omega fights out. Flips him over. Lifts him back up. Looking for a punch. Ziggler reverses. Tilt a whirl. DDT. Into the corner goes Kenny Omega now. Omega now into the other side. Huge shoulder there. Oh wait, but Omega fighting out. Omega now. Wait a minute. Again, Omega into the corner there. And a knee. Into the other side of the ring goes Ziggler now. On the top. What could be happening here? Ziggler tries to fight out, tries to go second rope. Omega fighting back. Omega a lot of elbows to the head. What could he be going for here? Wait a minute. Oh my god, Paisen Rana from the second rope. Oh my gosh. What a move right there by Kenny Omega and out of the ring goes Dolph Ziggler. Not done with him yet. Wait a minute now, Sami Zayn, what is he doing here? Trying to cause a distraction here on Omega. Omega now. Oh! He probably tried to hit Sami Zayn there, but Sami Zayn got out of the way. And with that, down goes... Oh wait, but now... Kenny Omega's had enough, and a huge V-trigger. To Sami Zayn, and now Dolph Ziggler catches him. Back suplex. That could be it. No, Omega back up. Puts him into the corner hard. Now... Omega lifting him up, deadlift, powerbomb, cover, one, two, and a kick out by Ziggler again, Ziggler rolling out of the ring. Now once again, wait a minute, oh, when he goes right through the middle of him, Ziggler ran away, oh, and look at this, into the barricade goes, can you make what the heck? Sami Zayn is attacking Omega. This is going to be another disqualification tonight. Man, I hope the main event will be different. Oh, man. Well, that's weird. On to the main event, I guess. And here we are. Main event time. Main event is underway. Here we go. This is going to be a technical one as they lock up already. You can see an arm wrench here, arm lock, wrist lock, whatever. Gets down on his and knee there. Gets his arm again. Still chain wrestling here. And I don't know what Mike Cole's watching. They lock up again. Now Matt Jackson takes the advantage. Takes him down. Yeah, he does. Back up now. Close line by Matt Jackson. Matt Jackson lifts him back up. The leg is caught. Huge dragon screw. Oh, wait, not a dragon screw. Just a normal kick reversal there. 
And Matt Jackson moved right there, and now he's trying to cut, uh, get him into the corner. Seth Rollins fighting out once again. And Matt Jackson reverses now. Seth Rollins into the corner, onto the top. Second rope, gets kicked. Oh, and down he goes. Matt Jackson not letting him climb. Count begins here, Matt Jackson cheering himself on. Matt Jackson now getting him up. Oh, no, wait. Rollins fighting back. Rollins puts him into the barricade. Rollins now. Snake eyes. That could be it right there. I could knock you out. And he is going to cover him here. After an assault on the outside. And a kick out by Matt Jackson. Not done yet, of course. Gets him up. Oh, a big knee to the face. Cover now. A kick out before one. Now, Rollins. Frog splash! That could end it right there. No, again. Out comes Matt. Matt is not done yet here. Now he reverses into the corner. Rollins reverses. Into the corner now goes Matt Jackson. Second rope. Top rope now. Looking for a superplex here, maybe. This, this is bad. This is going to be very bad. Oh my god, a superplex. Wait a minute. Rolling through. Falcon Arrow. Another cover in this matchup. So far, one sided. But Matt still kicking out, staying strong while. Rollins does the big moves. Now we're taking it to the arm. Getting him back up here. Looking at him. Super kick! Oh man! And now he's trash talking. Look, I just used your move. Cover! One! And a kick out at one out of the super kick. Man! That could have been it. Now Matt gets. Rollins into the corner. Rollins reverses again. Rollins second roll. Up he goes. Blockbuster. Gets him up. Flatliner. Rollins now puts him into the ropes. Leaps over. And a big drop kick countered by Matt Jackson. Matt Jackson tries to, oh, punch that super kick! Super kick to Rollins. Cover. One, two, good night. Well, no! Rollins kicks out. Rollins is still in this matchup. Nick likes this. He's telling him, hey, go top rope. Oh, man, here we go. 450. Splash. By Matt Jackson. Center of the ring. Could that be Ed? Wait a minute. What is he going for here? Sharpshooter. Locked in. This could be Ed. Is Rollins going to tap? He used his leg so many times in this matchup. But wait. Rollins fights out. Rollins gets out of it. And a huge end to Gary. Oh no. Rollins. Elbow. It might be. He rolls him through. And another super kick. Oh man. Rollins. Doing a little dance there. And you're trash talking him again. And now what is Rollins setting up for? Here we go. Rollins. Stomp. Gonna drag him to the center so there will not be any rope break. A cover by the number one contender for the world championship. After two big moves and the win. 
He kneed and stomped and super kicked as much as he had to to win this matchup. Is this exactly what Rollins is going to do in the main event of Last Stand? Next week we're of course going to find out the lockdown match competitors. Look at this. Ripcord. Or not Ripcord. Uh, Schoolboy super kick. Sev Rollins a huge win indeed. Man. No, no one's going to regret tuning in for that. At all. What a win for Seth Rollins. Good night, everyone.